Good morning everyone. My name is Natalie Mayanlike. Our topic for today is about parts of the microscope. What is microscope? A microscope is an instrument that can be used to observe small objects, even cells. The image of an object is magnified through at least one lens in the microscope. This lens bends light toward the eye and makes an object appear larger than it actually is. This is the example picture of a microscope. There are three structural parts of the microscope. Head. This is also known as the body. It carries the optical parts in the upper part of the microscope. Base. It acts as microscope support. It also carries the microscope, microscopic illuminators. Arms. This is the part connecting the base and to the head and the eyepiece tube to the base of the microscope. It gives support to the head of the microscope and it also used when carrying the microscope. Some high quality microscope have an articulated arm with more than one joint, allowing more movement of the microscopic head for better viewing. Optical parts of a microscope and their functions. Eyepiece, also known as the ocular. This is the part used to look through the microscope. It's found at the top of the microscope. Eyepiece tube. It's the eyepiece holder. It carries the eyepiece just above the object lens. In some microscopes, such as binoculars, the eyepiece tube is flexible and can be rotated for maximum visualization. For variance in distance, for monocular microscopes, there are non-flexibles. Objective lenses. There are, these are the major lenses used for specimen visualization. They have a magnification power of 40 times to 100 times. There are about 1 to 4 objective lenses placed on one microscope. In that, some are rear-facing and others face forward. Each lens has its own magnification power. Nose piece, also known as the, revol <coughs> the revolving turret. It holds the objective lenses. It is movable, hence in call, revolve the objective lenses depending on the magnification power of the lens. The adjustment knobs. These are knobs that are used to focus the microscope. There are two types of adjustment knobs, fine adjustment knobs and the coarse adjustment knobs. Stage. This is a section on which the specimen is placed for viewing. They have stage clips hold the specimen slides in place. The most common stage is the mecha mechanical stage, which allows the control of the slides by moving the slides using the mechanical knobs on the stage instead of moving it manually. Aperture. This is a hole on the microscope stage through which the transmitted light from the source reaches the stage. Microscopic illuminators. This is the microscope light source located at the base. It is used in, instead of a mirror. It captures light from an external source of a low vo voltage of about 100 volts. Condenser. These are lenses that are used to collect and focus light from the illuminator into the specimen. They are found under the stage next to diaphragm of the microscope. They play a major role in ensuring clear, sharp image and produced with a high magnification of 400 times and above. The higher the magnification of the condenser, the more image clarity. More sophisticated microscopes com come with an AB condenser that is high magnification of about 1,000 times. Diaphragm. It's also known as the iris. It's found under the stage of the microscope and its primary role is to control the amount of light that reaches the specimen. It's an adjustable apparatus, hence 
controlling the light intensity and the size of the beam of light that gets to the specimen. For high quality microscope, the diaphragm comes attached with the ab condenser and combined they are able to control the light focus and light intensity that reaches the specimen. Condenser focus knob. This is not this is a knob that moves the condenser up or down, thus controlling the focus of the light on the specimen. Up condenser. This is a condenser specially designed on a high quality microscope, which makes the condenser to be movable and allows very high magnification of above 400 times. The high quality microscopes normally have a high numerical aperture that, than that of the objective lenses. The rock stops. It controls how far the stages should go, preventing the objective lens from getting too close to the specimen. A slide which may damage the specimen. It is responsible for preventing the specimen slide from coming too far up and hit the objective lens. Light switch. This switch on the base of the microscope turns the illuminator off and on. Illumination, the light source of uh, the light source for a microscope. Older microscopes use mirrors to reflect light from an external source up through the bottom of the stage. However, most microscopes now use a low voltage bulb. Brightness and adjustment. It is used to vary the light that passes through the stage opening and helps to adjust both and contrast and resolution of a specimen. This is all the videos of the microscopes.